Welcome back guys. Today's task at hand is we're gonna redo the front porch. So there was originally carpet on that. It was like a old ugly brown carpet. Amber tore it up. She got majority of the glue and adhesive removed from it. Um, but we're gonna run to the store and buy some, uh, see if we can find some pavers to kind of match that brick there on the front. Um, eventually we're going to reside the house at some point. So we'll either do like a whitewash on it or we'll paint it something to try to match the house. So let's go to the store and, uh, pick up some pavers. self-serve was a hundred and five dollars so I ended up doing 18 of the patio pavers got four things of adhesive and a couple cutoff wheels just in case I know we're gonna have to cut something so let's head back to the house get our layout down and keep on going all right guys we just got back from the store we're gonna start by getting this cleaned all off and then we'll set our pattern up get it all laid down and We'll go from there. Let's see how this turns out. So I think this is the pattern I'm gonna go with. We'll have smaller pieces on each side just so they're not all right down the line and it kind of offsets it, it looks nice. It matches pretty good with the stone right there. Like I said, probably, um, you know, later on down the road when we decide to side, we will uh, paint that, paint the flooring, do like an acrylic paint or epoxy or something, whatever is gonna hold best on that, so. All right, so I'm gonna start by nipping one of these corners off, just cause there's that molding there and it kind of sticks out a little bit. So let's see how this works, I guess.
back from the store. We got a couple more cut wheels, that's all they had. So hopefully that's enough to get this finished up. I picked up some sand down there. Um, we got one, two, three, four pieces to cut. And then we'll have to cut these probably. So um, I also picked up some spray paint. I'm gonna spray paint this lower step right there. It's kind of, hopefully it kind of matches the color of the stone. It's a little bit, a little bit lighter, but it should look all right. So we'll see. It's a, it's like a textured desert. So it should look all right. So let's uh, get back to cutting. Slowly, slowly getting there. All this will be filled in with sand right here along the edge. Obviously all the cracks and stuff. I still gotta cut pieces for around the side. My battery died on the grinder, so I'm gonna have to go get those charged up and finish her uh, tomorrow probably. So, so we'll throw those batteries on the charger since they're dead. See you guys tomorrow. All right, guys, it's day two of working on this project. Got the batteries back. Uh, they're all charged up for my dad. So we got just this one, one brick left. And we got these four little pieces. If there's enough. I might try to pop those off and do one solid piece there, but we'll see. Um, so let's uh, get to cutting, I guess. We'll see, uh, see what happens. So if you guys are enjoying this content, make sure you smash that like button for me and subscribe. I post every Tuesday, so um, let's get to it. All right guys, we got all of our stones in place. I'm gonna go grab the leaf blower, get it blowed off, and put the sand down. That was tough cutting them two inch pieces. I should have probably got like, well they didn't have any 12 by 12s, but 12 by 12s would have been a lot less cutting probably. But it, it doesn't look too bad. I think it looks pretty good. Still gotta grind the front of that. Right down here. I'm gonna throw the grinding wheel on. I'm out of cutting this, so throw the grinding wheel on that, smooth that out, and then uh, we'll be able to throw a coat of that spray paint over it. So did a little bit of it yesterday just to see if it matched and it looked pretty good. So let's get the leaf blower fired up and uh, get the sand laid down.
like button for me and subscribe. It really helps me out. We're uh, going for our next giveaway, 500 subs. We got a little ways to go, but we'll get there. I know you guys are strong, so as always, shoot straight.